Okay, we're starting our lasagna filling here, the middle filling. We add uh, one chopped shallot, one red bell. Then we add spinach and we uh, just let it all cook down. So keep stirring and let it cook down the spinach. It'll cook way, way, way down. And then we add one uh, complete recipe of the bechamel sauce and uh, mix this all together. It's going to have, it's basically like a cream spinach that we're putting in the middle of this lasagna. And so that's the look it should have, like it does here. Yeah. Okay, so now we're doing Christmas lasagna. Uh, we got the filling made. Now I'm just going to make the layers. We've made red sauce already. Check the video archive. You can watch how to make it. And then we just layer the pasta sheets now. Just four, or three, excuse me, for a layer. Then we do a layer of uh, shredded mozzarella. Pretty light. Actually, a little more than that. Cheese is delicious. And then uh, I do a layer of fresh mozzarella as well. Like so. And then sauce. And then I always do opposite with the pasta sheets. I really don't know that it matters, but I just like to do it that way. And then we put the uh, funky filling in the middle, the cream spinach filling. Just plop it in, or pour it in. Pasta. You know, maybe we should do it like that here to absorb some of the more extra moisture. And then we're going to go back to the cheese. Fresh mozzarella. We'll just use the rest and then some more sauce. Christmas comes but once a year. This is we, what we actually make on Christmas Eve. We serve it with the spaghetti squash and then grilled sausages and uh, the red sauce as well. And it is awesome. You'll love it and so will your family. Last layer of pasta. Again, I'm gonna go. Okay, so we're gonna put Another layer of sauce on there. And then tons of cheese on top. Basically, I have an eight ounce bag here. I did one eight ounce bag on top and one eight ounce bag with the two layers in the middle with the fresh moth. So that's a good way to gauge it. Then from here, I'll show you where to go next. And then just for aesthetics, I line the top with tomatoes, Roma tomatoes typically, um, which is what these are. I do three in a row all the way down just because. And last, we do Parmesan on top. Boom. And then I'm going to pop this in the oven for 45 minutes. Cover with foil and then it's time to open presents. So after you bake for 45 minutes, you pull the foil off. 
bake for another half hour and there you have it. Christmas lasagna.